Hey guys, Retro Badger here. This is the USS Schumann, and it looks like a variation of the Vivas class, which was the Voyager 8, of course. However, this one has a third nacelle on the top. So could this be kind of like a variation of the X class? Could this be the Vivas X class? Hmm. I thought we'd try and get the attention of some Klingons, so I'm going to put this ship up against two Negvars. I don't know what sort of weaponry it's got, so let's find out. Okay, so we have photons. And blue phasers. Okay. Quantum torpedoes. So that's just like the original class, actually, apart from the phasers, of course. Although. The original could fire a blue beam from the front. However, all of them appear to be that colour now. Hmm. Maybe the Voyager A was a test bed. I do wonder if two Negvars was a bit of a uh, tall order, actually. Oops, I nearly clicked surrender, didn't I then? That's not good. I wonder what the Klingon's reaction is to surrender. Probably just laugh. Captain, their attacks are draining our starboard shield. Oh, I think we've taken the shield grid offline. Wow. Not bad, not bad. Target hull integrity at fifty percent. Oh, where have your other Klingon friends gone? Oh, there they are. Oh, there goes the bridge. The forward torpedo launcher doesn't work, from what I can tell, unless there isn't one built into it. It could just be the quantum launcher at the front. Hey, okay, gotta be careful here. Tractor beam has been disabled. Not bad. Their bottom is I have to be honest. At this stage, I think it's just a little bit more powerful than the original. Maybe in the phaser area, but the shields feel about the same. If I'm honest. Oh wow. Captain. Their shield system has been disabled. The quantums might load slightly faster. There we go. Well, that was a decent battle. This ship's currently available on Gamefront. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Bye for now.